All right, you bunch of hoes, let's cut to the chase. Here's how I rig this crane up with the 3DS Max Reaction Manager using sliders. Uh, just a quick run over. Here's the crane pedestal, rotates 360 degrees. Here's the knuckle boom one. And we've got knuckle boom two. All right, let's go. So the first thing I do is jump into this bad boy here, manipulators. You'll find that under helpers. Then, throw down a slider. Next thing I'm going to say is um, what we're going to name the slider. We want to call this pedestal. We'll then just copy that into the label and the maximum value I'm going to put in here is 360 because I want the pedestal to rotate 360 degrees. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is just double check the pivot point again. Um, so that's pointing up uh, on the Y. So we want to rotate it around the Y. The next thing we're going to do is jump into Reaction Manager found under Animation. Hit that bad boy, bring that up, keep that on screen here. Uh, and the first thing I'm going to do is select the slider controller. So we hit this green Add Reaction Driver icon, click there. We want to control the value. So that's from 0 to 360. Then we want to add the child or the reaction. So from here, we just hit that again. We then click on the first pedestal. And then we want to say we want to transform that bad boy on its Y rotation, as you've seen, the green axis. So that creates our state one. State one is just how you see it here. And what we want to say is we want to be able to slide this slider right to 360. And, pardon me, that's my breakfast coming back up. Lovely. 360 degrees. So, all we do is hit create mode. We then pick our pedestal. We then take our manipulator, ramp that right to 360. And then we hit E to shortcut into rotation mode. And just spin that bad boy right around 360 degrees. Okay. So then, once we've done that, we hit create state. So now you should have one state that we originally set up and the second state 360 degrees you can see up here. To test that, all we need to do is untick create mode, make sure manipulate is on, and then there we have it. Pedestal. Boom. Okay. I want to go a bit further, so let's do the same again. Hit the plus under manipulators, hit a slider. Again, we click on that, we call that knuckle boom one okay then we will do the same copy paste that into our label boom enter okay next we're going to double check um the axis on this um okay so we're looking at there we want to rotate that over the z axis this time just to make this a lot easier let's put that to mm, perpendicular right click on your transform hit zero okay so now we know that's zero that's perpendicular to our ground plane right so from here we're going to just go back into our slider controller here knuckle boom zero one i'm going to turn that to say 90 degrees because we want to control this knuckle boom from zero to 90 degrees okay so same again we go back into reaction manager we'll then add a um, slider controller here value from there or the reaction driver it's this knuckle boom 01 right here transform and we said we want it to rotate over the z that brings us our state one from here we just go create mode then slider put up to 90 degrees pick our knuckle boom hit e rotate that right up to 90 degrees then we'll hit create state, untick that create mode. And then what you should have is knuckle boom that goes from zero to 90 degrees. Perfect, easy, eh? Simple as pie. And just to uh, finish this one off, well, you probably get the gist by now, but I'll do this third one as well here. You know what they say, um, practice makes perfect. We go back in here, slider, boom, oh dropped that a bit early so we just go back into manipulate mode 
drag under here, call this Knuckle Boom 2. Boom 2 reminds me of Sonic the Hedgehog and Knuckles. Knuckle Boom 2. Okay, this Knuckle Boom has a bit of a higher degree of uh, movement. So if we check our box here, let's just say that's the maximum and it's collapsing under there. We will say that has moved 100 degrees. Okay, so let's just say 100 degrees. Let's just stick with 100 for now. So Knuckle Boom 02, go into here 100 degrees. Let's check the pivot. Go into pivot, check that Z axis, the blue one there. So we'll bear that in mind. Untick that. Come back into Reaction Manager, add Reaction Driver, pick our slider, the value of it, 0 to 100, pick our Reaction Driver, pick our Knuckle Boom 02, Transform, Rotation Z, okay, that's state 1, then state 2 will just be a matter of create mode, pick our slider, put it up to 100 degrees, create mode, Pick that, hit E, take that right in 100 uh, degrees. Okay, then we just bang create state. Come out of create mode. Now you should have perfectly animatable, fully rigged bad boy knuckle boom one and knuckle boom two crane. Easy as pie. Okay, hope that helps. Uh, please remember to follow, like, uh, comment, subscribe, whatever you want to do on my channel. Helps me feed my kids um, and helps me be able to uh, focus on creating these little tutorials for you guys. Okay, cheers. Thanks for now. See you in the next one. Boom. Bye.